As mentioned in the previous vlog, the traffic around Baguio was pretty intense this week, so we actually opted to hang out and spend more time in the B-Pod area, which is where our unit was located. So we found this place which caught our eye, House of Chops, since this restaurant was nearby and the interior looked very spacious. The timing for lunch was perfect too, since when we arrived, BGC Dreams was sitting at exactly 4,999 subscribers. Deep down inside, we were hoping it wouldn't be long until we had a special new milestone to celebrate while dining here. What's good for lunch today? How about some clam chowder, chicken pesto rolls, and some fried mozzarella to start off with? But mozza triangles. These two are hungry and also filming. <laughs> <laughs> bloggers gotta do what bloggers do. Beef belly. Wow, this looks good. So guys, crackling pork. Ribs, the beef belly, corn and spinach, mash, gravy, barbecue sauce, the jus, I guess, right? I guess the, like the drippings. Wow, look at that. Gotta bite that chicharrones. Ready. <laughs> Not quite the same. You gotta bite it. Yeah. Like your mat. Bite it like a true bossing. <laughs> yep. There, there you go, Ayun. There you go. Jenny being bad. What happened? All right, BGC Dreams hit the 5K bar. Congratulations. Bro. Thank you guys so much for all your support. We couldn't have done it without you. We were hoping we would get here before the end of lunch and uh, we did. Miraculously somehow. So thank you so much. Maraming, maraming salam. Thank you to the one subscriber. Thank you, whoever you are. <laughs> yeah, whoever you are, please leave a comment. <laughs> Who just uh, subscribed to us at what time? Uh, like 2.20. p.m. Yeah. So the big moment has arrived. So now we start the journey to 10K. Woohoo! Congratulations. Thank you guys. BGC Thanks. Dreams, Jenny and Jay. It's been one wild 5K. crazy journey and uh, we're just getting started. <laughs> more to come. Stay tuned for more. Real chocolate. We got the uh, fresh cream and this rainbow cake. I've already gained 20 kilos. Jenny has a glow on her face. <laughs> Looks mischievous. I remember Alabang is similar. Coffee break. He dreams ex Armenian Filipino never stop eating. Never stops eating. <laughs> we should put a food channel. No. Third. No. Food channel. I just need your guys' OA reaction. That you can never get from us. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, this is... okay, try it. <laughs> Can't hide the truth. No. Oh. oh, well. No, Mike can't lie, though. All right, you go. Let me try this. Yeah. Mm. Oh, it's good. Mm. Oh, it's good. The top is okay. Yeah. This one's dry. Right. Oh. So try these three. Oh, for two. It's this, this, what do you call this guy? The layers. The layers. La yeah. So try this, Jay. How about the, the rainbow? It's pretty, but that's what. <laughs> they're all a mist then. Yeah. Oh, it's man. It's colorful. Hey, perfect for kids. Okay, I hope their breads are better than. Oh, God, we got a lot. Can you see? It's okay. <laughs> I hope the breads are better. <laughs> Good luck if you don't like it. Okay, yeah, I should I should start by saying I am a huge devoted fan of Viscos. To me, that's probably the best strawberry shortcake in Baguio or can, in the Philippines. He can actually eat the whole, like, you know, the small Viscos. Yes, I didn't want to admit that, but thanks, Jenny. He can eat the whole thing. Okay, that's fun. Let's see. So I'm, I'm going to try to remember what Viscos tastes like first. Hmm. For sure, it's so easy for you. You eat the whole thing. It's not as moist. Yeah, I think that's the first thing. It's it's, it's dry. It tastes like like the actual bread. Yeah. 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 Mm. It lacks some uh, moisture. Yeah. Mm. So yeah. Maybe put water. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This guy here has a suggestion. 
Yeah, you, you put water, then go. Yeah, that's nice. <laughs> Normally, this is just basic fire. All right, well, we have viscose. Yeah, I think I'll appreciate viscose more when we go there. I don't eat strawberry, but that's the real deal. Do you want to eat this here or? Okay, we'll eat siguro kalahatit. Redemption. All right, this is what we came for. Can you tell from looking at it? Oh yeah, it looks yeah, moist. I can actually tell. I don't even eat strawberry cake, but I can tell that this looks good. One. <laughs> <laughs> nice, guys. It's good. It hits differently. What can I do? And guys, it's 580 for the small cake. I, I would assume the big ones maybe one, two. Right? Something like that. So affordable, Sean. For the quality of cake, guys. Really. Can't go wrong. Jay can actually finish the whole thing, you know, the small one. Mm -hmm. Me? I think this is enough. But you like strawberries, right? Yeah. Oh, guys, suck the last one. I'm about to say I'll feel good after it. But... Mm -hmm. It's that good. After two rounds of too much strawberry shortcake, we decided to head over to Camp John Hay for hopefully some light exercise. Here, they have all sorts of activities, such as driving go karts. And it's just an awesome place to hang out with family and friends. Where to now? We are gonna try to play golf. Whoa! <laughs> golf. Mini golf. <laughs> Don't say that. Just say golf. You know, it sounds rich. Are you a politician? Were you invited here? I don't know what I'm doing here. That's right. They even offer mini golf here, and we tried our best to join in. But as you can see, the lines were just too long, and there were just so many people waiting to play. So instead, we elected to do something else and probably something you wouldn't expect. That's right, we paid for tickets to go and check out the Butterfly Sanctuary. How's that for being random? Life Cycle of a Butterfly Let's say a life cycle of BGC dreams. Hey. We are at this level. Or maybe this egg yet. Egg. Not even a larva? That's kind of sad, bro. <laughs> this is BGC dreams now. Oh. Life cycle of BGC dreams. Caterpillar. <laughs> she said egg, not even larva. Kidding aside, guys. Thank you so much to the 5,000 subscribers. Oh, there's a that butterfly on me. Oh. There it goes. That is still watching and following us. We appreciate you. And finally, we didn't think our trip to Baguio would be complete without stepping into the original Amare restaurant. After all, this famous chain got started in Baguio, and who doesn't like hot pizza on a cold, chilly night? Because two Alvins was not enough. <laughs> oh my god, it's so good. It smells so good. Hi, salat talaga ang pagkain.